thumbnail. Hello all of my gorgeous guys and ghouls and you spooky queens in between. Today we are doing a Shein try on haul thing. I have opened the products already just to see what the quality was like because I'm quite funny with fabrics and some different textures freak me out so I didn't want to open them and go like oh. It's a big order so Ugh. we got all of this, all of this good stuff. So we're gonna try and try some stuff on. Why not? I ordered these on twenty. I want to say the twenty sixth of May, and they arrived today, which is the eighth of June. I'm not entirely sure when I'm going to be uploading this, but yes. So there was probably just over two weeks, just under two weeks worth of waiting time, which during this current pandemic and everything, it's still pretty cool to say that it's coming from. I want to say China. I'm not quite sure. Where I am a size, I'd say like a size 16 to 18 comfortably. Um, but I tend to get XL, double XL, anything like that. Just because I like baggy fits and it's just nice. So first up, we have got some a pyjama set. And I got these in a 1XL. Let me just get rid of this box. I got these in a 1XL. So first up, we have... Ugh. the pyjama top which is a short sleeve it's like a faux silk it's not going to be real I think I only paid like 10-15 pounds for this set it's 100% polyester but it honestly it feels so 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 soft and ugh, it's just so nice and I'm going to wear it later I think for bed and then the shorts are just some simple free flowing baggy shorts with an elasticated waist again i think they're 100 percent polyester yeah so yes 100 percent polyester and they've just got these the really cute little mushroom prints on which is adorable and i really really like them and look at this color my favorite color is green any shade of green you have the more ming in a color green i like like i'm on the search the perfect baby poop green lipstick and I cannot find it anywhere but we, we, we shall just continue to try and try and find it but yes this green is everything and I cannot wait to wear these um I shall insert a try on clip somewhere either a cutaway I don't know what I'm doing I'm trying my best but we will just go with the flow and see where it takes us can we just take a minute to appreciate how bomb these dramas are oh my goodness these feel incredible they are super roomy i've got a lot of room like sorry i've still got my bra on because i want to accidentally flash the ladies at you um yes they are super roomy and super comfortable the shorts fit really nicely like they're not digging into me again like can you can see they're like a really nice comfortable length. I'm going to pan you down now so you can see the length of them. So they just come, like they're a comfortable length under my bum, like my bum finishes here. And then you've got like a good inch and a half of fabric so you don't feel like you're walking around with your bum out kind of thing. Um, but yes, I can't wait to wear these to bed tonight, they're so comfortable. So as I said, I've taken everything out just to check the fabric and see how I feel about them. These ones were some that I'm kind of like, I don't know. I really wanted the two-tone, one leg, one colour, one leg, the other, trousers. Um, and this is what they look like. Like, they are really, like, can you hear them? They're super noisy, but they're just like a cargo pant with the pockets, real pockets on the leg. Um, and it's not a fitted, um, it's not an elasticated waist, sorry. It's a stitched waist and it's got belt loops on it and everything like that. But it's just, I hate the material. I hate, 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 hate it so bad. Okay, so I need to, um, ugh, sort of pocket out, but it's going to annoy me. So I've just teamed, I'm going to team all the trousers with um, just this black strappy top because I can't be bothered 
to faff about. Um, I don't even know how I'm going to show this on camera. Uh, we shall figure it out. But the waistband on these ones, it's the fitted structured waistband. It fits quite nice. There's a little bit of gaping, but I'm going to be wearing it with a belt anyway. I got these in a 1XL. So these are a size 18. And I'm glad I did because I don't think a 16 would have gone over my hips. They're... I'm going to have to take you off the tripod. Ugh. Hey, how are you doing? So um, they are a little bit like, you can see my pooch. My pooch I'm not too happy about. Um, and they're a little bit tight on this section, like around my bum. I feel like these are going to split. I feel like they're going to split really easily. But I don't know if it's because of the material. Like I just feel like I'm wearing a carrier bag. <sighs> The next item is two items. Oh, I forgot to say I got the trousers in a size 18. The next item, I am going to live my Billie Eilish fantasy in this outfit. You are not ready. It is, you see that neon green? Anyways, it is a super duper oversized t-shirt and baggy shorts with this gorgeous neon flame print. And I'm just going to show you because it's everything and I'm obsessed with it. And I'm going to live in this. I've seen so many other sets in this kind of style that I'm going to get as well. The fabric feels really nice, but like, look at the size. Oh, it's yellow. Did I get yellow? Yeah, I think it's, I don't know, yellow, green. But look at the size of this t-shirt for one. Like, let me just stand up. My body ends here. <laughs> it's super duper duper oversized. And I am just in love with it. Um... This set only went up into their size large, which is a 12 to 14. Um, so I was expecting it to come and not fit. And I was probably just going to end up having to wear it as pajamas or something. But I am obsessed with it. The sizing looks so good. And then the shorts that go with it are the same. They're a little bit see-through. Like, I don't know if you can see. You can't. No, you can't. Um... But again, elasticated waistband, it feels really like it's it's going to be nice, it's going to be comfortable sitting on your hips. I need to stop looking at myself and look at the camera. But yes, these are the shorts. And again, they're just super airy and flowy and like, oh, I think they're just going to be amazing. And again, I got these in the 12 to 14, which happens to fit, which is nice. I am so so happy the um flame co-ord set which i had to get in a large 12 to 14 because it didn't go into the plus size section oh it fits so nicely i don't know how well you're gonna be able to see it on my black backdrop but like it's super duper like there's my frame like here and then it's like super duper oversized baggy like the sleeves look at them like, oh, it's so comfortable. And then the shorts. I don't know why I did the Mario tune, but yeah. They are, again, super airy, flowy, comfy. I am a million, million and one percent getting more of these sets because it feels incredible. It's such a nice fabric. I'm trying to be daring with my outfits. Like, I'm trying to be more body confident and not really care about what I wear and like not that not that I don't care about what you wear um don't care about people's opinions and just rocking it and embracing my body like I am a mum of two I have given birth to beautiful chibis my absolute world my babies and um this is this is the body I was left with and I kind of feel like I'm rocking it so you yeah, know but anyways we'll go back to this haul this next item I got in an extra large, which I think 12, 14, is a 16. And it is, I don't know if you can see it properly, it says geometric print with, it's in like a fine mesh, like you can see my t-shirt, it is a see-through top. Um, but yeah, it's in this fine mesh detail on, it's like, I don't know if I can get close enough to show you, like the it's felted the geometric parts it's really really nice and on the website they just teamed it up with like a really cute bralette underneath it um it's cropped so it comes i mean where's my belly my belly button's here 
I feel like it's going to be like an under the bra crop, which I'm not 100% sure of. I've got some chunky, super chunky love handles, but I think with some high-waisted trousers, I won't mind the little, the little bit of a overhang. Okay. Okay. I'm so upset. I really, 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 really wanted to love this. Do I? I'm just looking in the mirror. Like, it looks cute on. It's the neck hole. I have a really small peanut head anyway. Like, everybody always, always calls me peanut because I have a really small head. Um, <laughs> in proportion to my body. Um, so, if I can struggle getting this over my head, if you have a normal sized head, you're not going to get this on. But I was just like, yeah, get it on for the video, come on. Um, the arms are very, I don't know if it's because I've just twisted it, oh no. I was going to say the arms are really tight, but now that I've untwisted it, it's not that bad. Um, they've got this, it's kind of like a, an overstitched raw hem, so it gives that, is it lettuce? Probably not lettuce. <laughs> it's got that kind of like jaggedy seam. But yeah, I really wanted to like this, but again, it's one of the really small cropped tops. Um, oh, I don't know actually, it doesn't look bad. Um, this is what it looks like. Again, it's really small cropped. How are we? Oh, it actually um, passes the arm raising test. But no, like I really, really love the print. Again, with these bright white tags, like come on. I'm going to have to cut them out and may hope that I don't ruin the top. But no, I, um, I've got to try and get out of this top now. Uh, wish me luck. Um, this next one is a pair of cycling shorts, again in an extra large. I got them um, extra large as a size 16. And they are, they're not amazing. They're like... Do you know like the cheap Primark leggings? That's what they feel like. Like they're not 100%. I'm pretty certain they're gonna be see-through. But I just, I just love them. I mean, even wearing these with a super oversized t-shirt, like I wear oversized t-shirts all the time. So it wouldn't be an issue if they are a little bit see-through. But yeah, they're just some, some plain cycling shorts. I don't know why I'm holding it up on my chest. They're just some plain cycling shorts that, um. A checkered and I thought they were really cute. I think we have another winner. <sighs> they are they see-through? I was looking in the mirror. Like, yeah, they're this slightly see-through, but they're not bad. They're really, really, really comfortable. I'm just gonna pan you down a little bit. So this is what they look like. They're like can you see? Are they see through? I don't think they are. Let's go a bit lower. Like, they sit in a really nice position. Like, I feel like it sucks me in slightly. It doesn't make me look as bad as what I am. I really, really like them. They're very, very comfortable. I just, yeah, I'm happy with these. I'm going to grab some more. Because, again, they had some flame style ones. And if you could tell by this haul, I quite like it. I like that print. So I'm going to get some of them. Mm -hmm. Oh, would you look at that? It's another check print. So this is an extra large again. So a size 16. And this is another mesh top. Another checkered item. But like, making my, my eyes go funny. But mm, I love it so much. I think this is my one of my favorite items. Other than what's next. I mean, I like all of it. All of it looks bomb as hell. Obviously, otherwise I wouldn't have ordered it. And it wouldn't, like... It wouldn't have been to my taste if I didn't like it. But, oh, God, they're just so, so nice. And I cannot wait to try them all on. Uh, I just really hope that once I do try them on, that they don't look like... And I can actually rock it. Which I'll see. Please, fingers crossed. Okay, so... Oh my god, this next top, again, it fits really nicely. I, I'm not never going to be able to lift my arms up. Let me just uh, 
sort myself out. I'm never going to be able to lift my arms up in this because it is hella short. I'm going to show you in a minute. But again, I like the collar. It's not a high collar like the other one. Still feels really nice. Um, again, I've had two children. So don't be Judy McJudson. <laughs> this is what the top length is. Like, again, it's, I really like it. It is very, very cute. Let me just put my chair in. Like, it is very, very cute. I've just got, um, see, like, that's my arm lifted up. You can see the bottom of my bra. So we, we can't be doing that. But no, I really, really like it. The fit feels very, very nice. It's super soft on the skin. And yeah, I did like it. So this next item is again another see-through top. Whether I wear these with a bralette or if I layer a top underneath or something, I'm not quite sure yet. But um, I don't know, I was just really digging this whole vibe and I wanted to grab a few bits. So, oh my God, look at it. Oh, it's awesome. How freaking cool is that? So it's a full length one. So the length of this top is so much better than the others. Like I'll be able to tuck this in to um, trousers or anything like that and feel comfortable in it, which I'm so, so, so hyped about because this print and like the material, it's mesh, but it's like, I don't know. It's got that white. I don't know how to explain it. Like it's really, really, really soft. It feels really nice. I imagine it's going to feel so nice when you're wearing it. And it is made of polyester again. I think a lot of stuff is made of polyester because this is not like a really cheap, a cheap fabric to make things in. I don't mind. I mean, if I can get a few wears, well, a handful of wears out of this before I rip a hole in it with my nails or the kids pull on it or something like that, then I'll be happy because it was just a right bargain. It was a right bargain. So here is the flame print mesh top. Um, I'm trying not to get demonetized. I don't even think I am monetized. It's just what all the YouTubers say. I don't want to get done for flashing some tatas, but yes. Um, it fits really nicely. Like it's not, it's not got any excess fabric. The collar isn't choking me. Like I've got room, but it's, it sits nicely. Um, the length, I've just got it tucked into some black leggings right now. But like the length is really nice like you can see my back rolls but i ain't mad because i am obsessed with this top like this tag i'm gonna probably have to see if i can cut it out um just so it's not so like in your face tag but i love it it fits really nicely it's very very comfortable but yes the next item is and these feel like trousers they don't feel like expensive nice trousers but they don't feel like the parachute pants did but these ones are like this. And again, I am obsessed. Um, also buzzing. They do not have, oh, they do. Mm, they've got a tiny little tab size sticker, the uh, size tag thing. So I could possibly, I could potentially wear them either this way or that way. I don't know if the bum's got more fabric or not. We shall see. But I think this is the way it's supposed to be worn. Yeah. So this is them. They have a ooh, a straight leg bottom. I probably would have preferred a cuffed bottom with these so I could like style them up a bit more. But honestly, I'm not mad. Like the fabric feels really nice and lightweight. Um, they'll be nice for this transition from summer to spring, uh, from spring to summer, and just something a little bit different. Spicing up the wardrobe a bit. Oh, I can't breathe. Okay. So I've got the black and white. <laughs> I have got the black and white. Ugh. I've got the black and white trousers on. They are super not flat. Like look at how tight they are. They are so tight. They are digging into me so bad. I I did all the sizing and measurements, like what it told me to do, and clearly I don't know because these are like hurting like I've got them on but I ain't gonna be able to sit <laughs> like I can't bend I'm terrified I'm gonna burst out of them <sighs> I'm honestly so bummed and I can 
guarantee that the chef trousers are going to fit me perfectly. I'm going to keep them out of principle. Oh, no. <laughs> I'm stuck in these trousers now. Oh my god, I actually am. Shoot. <laughs> I can't get out of them. Oh my god. Sorry, no, I didn't. Oh I'm so sweaty from trying to get these trousers off. Oh my god. Oh. So the next item, my daughter actually picked this item. She's six years old and well she's six in july and she said like mummy like you're so beautiful oh my thanks <laughs> um but she says she was upset that i don't wear dresses i don't like wearing dresses i am a leggings and oversized tea girl all the time through and through even when it's like melting outside even when it's freezing outside that is what i'm wearing um but yeah she saw this she's like oh my god mummy you have to get it it's gorgeous and I'm not going to lie, I am a little bit in love with it. On the picture, I was just kind of like, oh, would I wear it? Would I really wear it? I don't think I would. But now that it's come, I'm eating my words. The fabric, it feels so like, well, look, this is the fabric for one. The fabric feels amazing. It is a weighty dress. So it has spaghetti stripes, uh, stripes. Spaghetti straps and like faux tortoise shell buttons. I don't know if you can see. Yeah, there they are. And they go all the way down the dress. It isn't a real opening and closing fastening thing. They're just there to show, like to look like it, to give the illusion. And I am just in love with it. It is so, so, so nice. It's got a um, an elasticated band around just under the bust. Can you see? So that will give you a nice cinched in waist and then the back has this elasticated stretch do you know that that kind of material and it has pockets so exciting but yes i love this dress i don't know how well i'm going to be able to show it just because i don't know how to set my um ring light up anywhere other than where it is i don't have enough room in this room but I'm going to try and do my best to show you what it looks like. Look, it's so pretty. It has pockets. Like, it fits so, so nicely here and around the back. I mean, it doesn't dig in, so I've not got... Do you know what I mean? This part, is, a back, is it classed as a back roll? Is it like an armpit roll? I haven't got them, so I'm more than happy with this. The length is... <sighs> just to my knee. I don't know how I'm going to film this like to be able to show you properly. It's just to the knee. It covers bum perfectly. It's just so comfortable. This part doesn't dig into me. Like it cinches in where it's supposed to without cutting me in half kind of thing. Like I really, 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 really like this. It's so pretty and the little tortoise show buttons. Like it just, it just ties it all together. I think it's very pretty and it's going to look amazing in the summer with maybe a big oversized black fluffy hat and some bottle top glasses kind of thing. That's the vibe I'm going for anyway. Like a spooky summer witch kind of thing. Okay, next item is another pair of trousers. Um, these ones I didn't think I was going to like, again, um, just because... I don't wear that much colour, so if you've noticed, like, it's been black things with a splash of colour, do you know what I mean? But I bought the, I bought these trousers because I have a top that is exactly the same like this, and I love it, I wear it all the time. But these trousers are amazing. They feel like pyjama bottoms, but I can wear these out of the house. They probably look like pyjama bottoms too, but I don't care. It has chains, it has a belt. <sighs> Look at them! Oh my god, I'm so, 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 so in love with them. So these, I got these in a size extra large. This is a size 16. Um, they have an elasticated waist. They also have a belt, which I haven't fastened or anything. And, I mean, this chain looks a bit, a bit flimsy and a bit naff, so... I'd probably either just take it off or replace it with like a chunkier chain or something. 
but oh my god, I'm so in love with them and they look like pajama bottoms and they feel like pajama bottoms and they're just going to be the most comfortableest, is that even a word? I don't think it is, the most comfortable pair of trousers ever. I just really hope they fit right in the right places, like they're not too crutch happy, they aren't, I mean they look like they're super baggy and like gonna have lots of movability and stuff but they've got pockets on the side um there's no pockets at the top which is pretty pretty crappy but I'm, I'm 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 more than happy i mean nine times out of ten i'll wear like a jacket or a backpack anyway or i could shove everything in my pockets i don't necessarily put anything in trouser pockets anyway but yes i'm very happy with them i'm certain my waist and my hips are a size 16 to 18. My bum, on the other hand, is like a size 20, 22 because this is now, I don't know what order these are being filmed in, but this is the second pair of trousers I've tried on. I've got them further than the other ones. That's where they are. Could you see them? Could you see them? Like, I can't get them over my bum and I'm just like, trying to edge into them because they're the green pajama style ones and i feel like once i get them past my bum they'll be all right but then how am i gonna get them off oh my god this is you can't see this is as far as we've got i'm red hot and sweaty i'm trying to get them on um as they get higher and higher I can feel that it's going to be super tight on my bum. So again, another return. So uh, in my attempts of the wardrobe revamp, I thought it would be very, very cool to insert some colour. These uh, are very bright. But honestly, they look incredible. They look so, so, so cool. So these are both in extra large. So again, a size 16. I am obsessed. So this is like a super duper neon green. It says baby girl on it. I know it's inverted and it's backwards because I'm using my front camera because I've never filmed before. And I wanted to make sure I was in focus and everything. I will get better filming setup and everything when I get more confident with this, but yes. So it's this super silky soft material. It's gonna be like body hugging, which I don't mind. Just kind of grope myself on camera, but hey. Um, it's, uh, where are we? So this is 97% polyester, 3% spandex. So, I mean, it's got, it's got a lot of stretch and same as said, it's going to hug nicely. It's got this little high neck, which I think is gonna look super cute. I really like it. I really, really like it. Um, I'm gutted that I'm in the wrong camera so you can't see what it says, but it says baby girl. And I'm baby girl. Okay, again, I apologise that the graphic text is um, the wrong way around. It says baby girl. It isn't like an iron. It doesn't feel like an iron on, like it doesn't feel like vinyl. Do you know what I mean? Feels like it's part of the top my uh the collar's a bit gapy in places i don't want it to be like ideally i need it to be like that but there's like these bits so i'm not overly hyped about that the fit of it feels really nice again it's got the longer sleeves but not as long as the other one um it's slightly see-through again like you can see that i'm wearing a black bra but I don't I think I can get, get away with it more with this top it's a nice length crop it's not gonna yeah it's not gonna show I'm not gonna be flashing me tatters at anyone um but no I really like it it's really soft fabric feels very nice on I don't know how it's gonna wash um I don't think I've got anything this material that I can kind of be like oh yeah this washes like this so we're just gonna have to wait and see how it washes but no I, I do I do quite like it I need to stop groping myself Jeez. Top number two, exact same style. I think it's got a different collar. Oh, where are we? Oh no, no, it has the high neck as well, and it says 
illuminate this outside. But yeah, this is like a neon orange. I mean, it's coming across a whole lot darker on camera. Like this is bright. This is like traffic cone reflective in your face bright. Like oh, you can't see it. It's honestly so so bright. But it just says rainbow on the high neck collar again, and I think it's it's got it on both arms. But I do, I just love these tops. I ummed and awed about them for ages when I was making my basket up. And I was like, just do it. Just do it, Chantal. Like, you're only going to regret it. You're probably going to end up ordering them in your next order if you enjoy the products that you purchase. So just do it now and rock the Neon Fantasy. So we did it. We did it. Okay, this is the orange, neon orange uh, rainbow print in like gothic writing top the sleeve length is long but i i dig this like i may even like cut some holes in it so it's like over my thumbs but this fabric is really nice it clings but it it's not uncomfortable clinging i like the collar on it it's really really comfy um the only issue is i'm wearing just a plain black bra like you you can see that bra i can see that bra so i know full well you can see that bra so I don't know how I would wear this. Like, do I have to go out and buy a neon orange bra now? I don't know, but I do really like it. The fit, again, let me just stand up and... It fits just above the belly button and it goes around. Like, it's just a plain orange, like slightly cropped top. I mean, I wouldn't ever wear anything lower than this anyway. Like, there's my belly button. I wouldn't wear anything lower than this sitting. I mean, even if it was like rolled up a bit, I still think it looks really cute. You know what I'm saying? Like I'm trying to get a bit more confident with my body. This next item is an extra large again, so size 16. And this, it's green again. You know I love green. This is absolutely gorgeous. I am obsessed with this top. Oh. Obviously, you'll see it better in the try-on clip, but it is this gorgeous tie-dye, like, stripped green and black top. The length is perfect. It's not too long that it's, like, dress length. It's not too short that it's, like, it's going to cover my stomach, which is good, and that's, like, a problem area for me. Um, but it's it's beautiful. The fabric... It feels nice. It doesn't feel necessarily expensive. But do you know what? I ain't mad about it. I think it's going to... It's 35% cotton, 65% polyester. So we're slightly, getting, we're slightly getting a bit better with the quality of the product. But I'm just... I'm so in love with it. It's so pretty. Can we just... I knew this was my favourite for a reason. It fits like a dream the sleeves don't like dig in to my finger wings which is always a winner when it comes to short sleeve tops the collar again it's it's shaped nicely around the neck but it has a bit of gaping so i don't feel like i'm choking the length of it is everything it comes probably about an inch below my belly button it fits really nicely it's not see-through or anything this is the back but i love this top i think it is so so nice and i cannot wait to wear the absolute hell out of it because i feel incredible in it Ugh. now as i said i went through this box and i checked to see how everything was made sure that the fabric and everything wasn't going to creep me out these trousers on the model looked amazing the outfit ideas i had in mind to wear with these was perfect everything was so 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 beautiful and then they arrived and these feel like parachute pants which i ain't mad about they will be super like comfy and lightweight in uh the summer when it gets a bit warmer or if i get sweaty they're gonna stick but yes, I'm hoping when I try them on, they don't look as bad. Because at the moment, 
all I can see is like I'm trying to be a chef. Well, this is what they look like. I'm still, I'm still so on the fence about them. Like I really, really love them, but I hate them so bad so they've got the cuffed bottom which i wanted on the other ones that feel like this i'm sure it was the other ones that felt like this and not trouser material um nice stretch um but yeah i just feel like i'm gonna look like i want to be a chef or something in it do you know what i mean I don't know. I'm going to have to try them on and see. I haven't filmed this try-on in the order that I've shown you in the video. But um, the all of the trousers like are super like wrongly sized. Or I've just missed inches of measurements to be able to see what my size is when I was ordering which is kind of bumming me out for what I've got coming next week because I'm certain I've ordered some more stuff dang it um the uh the chef trousers fit I knew they would just to spite me because like four pairs of trousers don't fit me I cannot get them past my hips. I have huge, 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 huge hips and a massive bum. But the chef trousers fit. And see, I don't think that I look like a chef much anymore. I feel like I look like a clown, which I'm totally down for that vibe. I am honestly totally down for that vibe. Like, they just fit really nicely. I don't know how I'm gonna, like they fit nicely on the crotch. I can't, oh God, I can't lift my leg very high. Um, I don't know how I'm going to film it. Can I lower it down? Oh, I can. Woo! There we go. So they fit very nicely on the bum area. You can see my pouch a bit, but again, I've had two children. I do not care. It doesn't give me toe of the camel. We don't want that. Um, the elastic is really, really nice and like they do fit. It is slightly like figure hugging here, but you know what? I'm not mad at it. They're not feeling restricting. I don't know how I'm going to show you the bottom. <laughs> <laughs> so they've got the cuffed leg again I actually think I really like them so the next item is in a different bag this one is from Rome, Romwe, Romwe I don't know it's from Shein anyway uh, again an extra large which is, is a size 16 and this is a co-ord set and I don't think I would wear this as a co-ord set. I am 110 million percent not body confident enough to wear this as a set. You will see why in a minute. It's very midriff showing and that is my problem area. But I would rock the top with a different set of trousers. I would rock the bottoms with a different top. Do you know what I mean? But yes. So first up, I will show you the top. So it is just this gorgeous, like off the shoulder, the sunflower print as well yes it is this beautiful and it feels slightly parachutey but not as parachutey as the pants that is great descriptive descriptive narrative there Chantel but yes I just feel like it's going to look super cute in the summer when I'm trying to get a little bit of a tan on my shoulders like I'm quite pasty I like being pasty and then these are the shorts the shorts are tiny there's loads of stretch in them. I just don't know if they'll be comfortable or not. I mean, I hope they would. Fingers crossed. But there's um, there's no pockets. They've kind of just got like this. Oh, that's split up the side. Oh, that's even nice. Oh, I like it. They kind of split up the side. Not all the way up. They kind of. Yeah, they overlap about this much. So you're not going to be flashing your lady bits to anyone okay so next i have got on the off the body uh, off the shoulder bandeau top 
I didn't think I was going to like this. I honestly didn't think I was going to like this. But I am in love. It is so nice. I was worried with, like, I thought the sleeves were the other way around for one. So they're really like loose and flowy, but then they've got elastic. So they're going to stay on your arm. You're not going to have to be constantly pulling them up or anything. I mean, you wouldn't want to pull them up because it is an off-the-shoulder top. But they they ain't moving. They are staying there. And like, it feels nice on the bingo wings. It feels good. And this is like a really nice panel length for my midriff. Like, I'm not mad at it. Now, will I wear it with the shorts? Probably not, but I'm going to try it on anyway. Uh, wish me luck. These shorts are too tight. They are going to be hella uncomfortable. Um, I don't think I would ever wear them. And also, I don't think I'm going to be able to show on camera because there's there's a lot of butt. But like, this split... Yeah, that that's my pants there. Like, this split goes all the way up it is not attractive at all um i've got severe toe of the camel going on um and yeah it's just it's digging in and like hurting me and making me feel uncomfortable and because of the the paneling like this bit it's super super loose on my bum so the smallest gust of wind i am going to flash my bum at everyone and trust me nobody wants to see that so the next we're getting down to the last one two three we have three things left so this what is this <gasps> some trousers these are an 18 um why did i get these in an 18 It might be that there wasn't a 16 because what I've done is anything with an elasticated waistband I've kind of stayed to a 16 because obviously they would stretch a little bit if I needed them to and anything with a fitted structured waistband I've gone for an 18 because if again if they were too big I could wear a belt with to cinch them in a little bit because I am at 16 to 18 it's just deciding which day which day I want to fluctuate kind of thing but these the writing is going to be backwards again so I'm so sorry but these again say baby girl on them in like this super like gory graphic that was my daughter this super graphic um super gothic graphic like almost like blood dripping print and i'm in love with it it has cropped bottoms again which i'm in love with these are gonna look so 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 dope with my boots and things like that even with my vans um, they're just so nice. There's no pockets again, unfortunately. It has, oh, so this is a real drawstring as well. So even if they are a bit bigger, I can cinch them in a bit more. But yes, oh, this is what they look like. They're, they're less parachute-y than the parachute pants. <laughs> like they don't feel as plasticky. Like there is a little bit of a, a, a clothing feel to them. I love the graphic baby girl trousers again i need to figure out how to set up my camera so i can better film outfits i want to get a floor length mirror at some point so i can show you in the mirror but then the text would be inverted again i don't know i don't this i'm, I'm new to this give me a break give me a chance but yes they fit i have tied i've cinched in a little bit so there's not as much give because i've cinched the the string in but let's just pan you down a bit this is the crutch region i don't feel like i'm not getting toe i don't think but yeah sorry again that the text is the wrong way i feel like as i wash these and as i wear them they're going to tear um the vinyls going to crack and stuff like that but i don't mind they're really nice and like loosely baggy on legs like they feel they've got lots of room in these yeah i can see me getting a whole heap of wear out of these like i really 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 like these trousers but okay the next second to last item is another size 18 what are you ah so these 
I think what it was is I bought these trousers. I put these trousers in my basket and it then, same as I said, based on prints and style and design and things like that, they then recommend you like, oh, here's, because you like these, you might like these too. And that's where I got the chef trousers from. Hopefully they look good when I try them on. If not, they're going straight back. But yes, I got these ones and I really, really like them. So let me just um, figure out what's what. But these, these feel like parachute pants again. But you know what? I'm not even mad at these ones because they are so nice. So it's just black with a chunky belt. Then it's got checker print pockets. Like, oh, it's so cool. And they've got the cuff bottom again. Yes. The cuffed bottom is everything. I don't want to look smart when I'm uh, wearing these. But the uh, the ones that aren't, I could possibly like turn them up a little bit and then wear them with boots. So it gives that more edgy kind of vibe because I just feel like they're going to look too much like smart trousers. And I don't want them to look like that. But yes, they're so pretty. I love them. The black trousers with the checkered pockets on the side. I cannot get them past much higher than my knee. These are a 1XL. So these are supposed to be a size 18. Oh, it's got a zip. It's got a zip. Oh, please, 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 please. Oh, no. Can you see that? Like, that is the zip. There's my underpants. They do not fit in the slightest. And I'm so upset because I really, 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 really wanted these ones. And they made me buy the chef ones. And then we are on to the last, the final, last hurrah piece. And these, I, I genuinely think I've saved the best to last. Other than that co-ord, like that co-ord is sick. I am obsessed with it. I don't know what it looks like when I've tried it on yet. Because I'm going to try it on after all of this. But obviously you will have seen it clipped in after each item. But this again is a size 18. So it's um, 1XL on their site. Um, what I did, it um, gives you like... A size generated random quiz thing it like it's like a picture of a skinny a bulky a slightly overweight like overweight and like it just keeps going so you like kind of select what body frame you are what you like to wear how you like to wear it if it's like close um, tight close loose comfy and all this stuff and you kind of break it down and it does your sizing that way so I did that first and then afterwards I also just went and measured myself because all of the sizes like underneath it'll be like xl in brackets 18 and then underneath it'll be 106 blah 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 centimeters for bus 100 and some for this waist but like it tells you all the measurements so there's no way that you can possibly go wrong but it just depends on how the style fits i feel like even though all of these look like they're going to be a really good fit they might not suit my body shape right who knows but yes anyway Pardon me. The last item, there's, there's a lot of straps that I need to fasten up and stuff. The, these are taking me back to when I was, God, like 12, 13 years old. And I lived, lived. Can you remember the big baggy, par again, it's parachute pants, the big baggy like parachute pants, but they had all the really like tassely things hanging off of them. And like, Alternative people will know what I mean because I wore mine to death. I think I had backup pairs. So if like one of my tassels ripped off, I was like, no, let's get the new pair out. Like I was obsessed with them. They were amazing. Um, but yes, I saw these. They feel again like pajama pants. So they're going to be super duper comfy to wear out all the time. But they are red tartan. Look at them. They have got... The cuffed bottom, again, one tick. They feel like pyjamas, two tick. The nostalgia, oh, they have a stretchy waistband, three tick. It has belt loops, so I can even add a swanky belt onto it. It, oh, it comes with a plain black buckle belt. And I really like these chunky buckle belts. I just don't know how to fasten them. So I need to figure out how you do that. Um, and then on the pockets, it's got... Again, the chunky buckle, and again, I need to fasten it up. But I don't know, you know, I might just leave it down. Like, nostalgia, what? I'm obsessed. I am so in love with them. I wanted 
some red checkered trousers for as long as I can possibly remember and these feel incredible I just hope they fit right because these might be like an absolute favorite of mine now like firm favorite staple staple awesomeness trousers and they just feel so nice and it's just gonna be like going out the house in pajamas and who doesn't want to be able to do that all the time hmm? please 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 fit please if you are a size 18 the ones that didn't fit were a size 16 these should fit please okay so let's just pretend for a second that your girl knows how to fasten one of these uh, kind of belts because it looks hot mess but they fit they fit and they're so comfortable oh my god so let me just pan you down a bit so yeah let's just ignore the belt i don't know if i've done it right but oh, oh my god they're so comfortable they don't feel tight on the bum like i've got a bit of give the legs are super roomy like i feel i could do jumping jacks and all sorts in these let me just pan it down a little bit further so you can see them a bit better like the cropped i think do they go all the way down my leg no like i'm five foot nine and they fit like just above my ankle and oh like they've got so much movement in them and i'm so happy they fit i'm so, I'm so happy that was the end of this haul. Let me know down below if there was anything that was hit and miss for you, what you liked, what you disliked, if you want to know any more about the products. Um, the same as I said, the shipping time was phenomenal. To say that we're in the middle of like country lockdown and things like a worldwide lockdown, a uh, little over two weeks, I was expecting, I think my delivery date was like the 12th or something daft like that. So it came early, came like nearly half a week early, which is obviously a winner. I have another order coming. Um, so that's probably going to come next week, week after. Um, by the time you've seen this, I've probably already got my second one. I've probably already been out rocking it. You've probably seen outfits on my stories on Instagram and stuff. I'll leave all my handles down below. I've only got Twitter and Instagram. Jesus. Um... But yeah, I don't think I did too bad at this filming malarkey, other than that I keep looking there and not there. But yes, I hope you're all staying safe. I hope you are all being kind to one another. I hope you're all, I don't know, just living the best possible life you can and just being absolute gems. But yeah.